Okay, welcome to another YouTube episode of CDR Labs Chandigarh Data Recovery. And uh, in the last episode, uh, you saw that we had received one MRT Ultra card for one of my students, and uh, I had done an unboxing uh, video on that, and I, I had shared my views with that. So now we are shooting the next video. In this video, we are first going to register this card. Then we are going to install it. So the entire registration process and the entire uh, installation and setup process we are going to discuss in English language for you. And uh, uh, till the next frame, uh, just uh, wait. All right, guys, Eid Mubarak. How are you? <laughs> this is the fourth or the fifth time today we are trying to shoot the registration of MRT it is beyond my head it's not a problem with the MRT but what's going on is sometimes the bloody battery has gone then the card is not working then the electricity goes then this then that oh man it is evening time now since morning we are trying to shoot that so anyway we will still shoot it and try Okay, so let's talk about the registration process of MRT. Uh, for registration, we first of all need to go to their main English website, en.mrtlab.com. And uh, once we are there, we need to take our mouse to user center, click on to product registration and then we will reach their vip.mrtlab.com front slash en front slash website where we are supposed to do registration of our tool so when we click on to center the first option is register and when we click on that then it is asking us for registered username set up password confirm password company name contact name gender <laughs> So, uh, Wendy, there are three type of genders in the world, not two type of genders, male and female. There has to be an ETC also. So make sure that you modify the script to add the <laughs> ETC also. Anyway, then birth date, country, province, then city, detailed address, PIN code, ID card number. This should be the serial number of your card which will be there inside the card at the back on a on a piece of paper then it says connect ways how MRT lab can connect with us email ID QQ number QQ is very famous in China so they have added QQ number here but other people don't use too much QQ then mobile phone website other ways of contacting us then other information which is publicly viewable like technical expertise, company introduction, verification code and after this we, we press the submit button. Yes, another small thing I wanted to discuss is that when the initially the there is nothing in the verification code. As soon as you click on to the white box, you take your mouse and click there, the verification code pops up on the right hand side of that. Like in this case, it is 0432, like that. All right. So after we press the last screen, we have reached this new area uh, where it is having like my information. Then it is having uh, in my information, we have modified details, change password, reseller panel, my orders. In my orders, we are not getting any detail. Possibly they'll activate the account first. Then only I think it will uh, show the details here. Same with my orders. Um, sorry, my devices, I think. Might be if you have multiple devices, you can have one, one registration name and you can have multiple devices inside that. Then when you press the recharge, it takes you to another recharge area where you can put the amount. And it clearly says MRT Express dollar one fifty per month, MRT Ultra dollar one eighty per month. So as far as my student is concerned, after one month of free access, 
he will need to enter he will need to give them 180 rupees per month for the next 23 uh, odd months so that uh, uh, once this is totally done then this card becomes his till then it is not uh, permanently his then we go to transactions here the number of transactions he has done are recorded but as this is just registered we don't see anything device activation this is the area where you will actually enter the machine code which you will uh, get and then it will generate a, a, a registration code which you have to enter back into the tool uh, until unless that thing is not done the tool will not run so i think we'll have to wait for a day before uh, windy and everybody else activates uh, uh, our tool but I, I, I'll still try, I, I would like to install the card into one of the machines and see how it is, uh, uh, whether if I input the details here and uh, if I get the registration code, will that uh, work or will that not work? So that thing we can cross check. So let's uh, do that uh, now and I'll shoot the next frame with the details on that.